Hello guys, so I thought I would do a unboxing video because something has arrived in the mail. Um, it's not a jelly cat, it's not a Charlie bear, it's something completely different. So I don't know if I've mentioned this before in other videos, but I think I have, I'm not 100% sure. But I also collect a brand called Rendale. So they do things like mugs, um, key rings, they do gardening equipment as well. They do like ex um, cooking equipment, um, crockery, things like that. They're just nice sort of homeware things and accessories and makeup bags and lunch bags and things like that. And it's all really nice and it's all watercolour paintings of animals. Um, if you don't know it, check it out. It's called Rendell Designs. I have quite a few things from them. I've got a purse. I've got a mug. I've got a key ring. I've got a few other things as well, but I can't remember. But I really like their designs, so I collect little things from them as well. But they've also started doing plush toys. Um... And apparently they're really well made and quite similar to Jelly Cat. And I saw this online and I absolutely fell in love with it. Um, and I just had to get one. I just had to. It wasn't too expensive either. Um, and I am on a ban from getting any sort of like really sort of more high end stuff like Charlie Bears or like the more expensive Jelly Cats. But I am allowing myself the odd little thing here and there um, for like a, a few months or so. Um, but I haven't bought a Charlie Bear for I don't know how long. Not that long, like a few weeks. But um, I'm going to try and not get one until at least June. Um, because I did go a bit crazy with them. Um, when I first started collecting, I'd buy like one every month, sometimes more. Um and it yeah it just because I kept seeing good deals or I kept seeing ones that I could, didn't see anywhere else um and yeah I just I'm kind of on a bit of a ban I'm trying to be sensible now but this wasn't too expensive and I'd had my eye on it for absolutely ages I wasn't having a good week I was having quite a stressful week um so I thought to cheer myself up, I got it. I finally bit the bullet and I got it. And it was for a really good price. It was from a place called Purple Holly, um, which is based in Lincolnshire. It's like a gift shop that does like Rendell. It does Jelly Cat. It doesn't do Charlie Bears, but it does do nice things. So um, this is just a little unboxing video for you. Um, so... A little a little delivery note um not that interesting oh i can see it so this god there's a lot of these things in there this is elvis so he's got a little tag there. I'm not going to lie. I'm kind of disappointed that it didn't come with the canvas bag that um, they used to come with. Um, but I am really, really pleased. Really, really. That, that's really nice material there. Um, really soft. It's like kind of, I don't really know how to describe it. There's like the sort of different plush here. Really soft there. He's got lovely big eyes. He is so cute. I am really, really happy. Really, really happy. Absolutely adorable. I love the little tag as well. But yeah, they um, there's like, I don't know how many of them there are. I think there's like maybe six no i think there's more than that i think there's like nearly 10 actually um but there's an owl there's a rabbit there's a fox but the owl is 
the best. Definitely 100% the cutest one. Um, but yeah, really, really happy with that. Love the different kinds of material. This is the softest, this and this. Um, there's like loads of different kinds there. There's like, I'm not really sure, it's like kind of a... Uh, kind of like a bit woolly but like really soft I can't really describe it but then this is just like a kind of more coarse plush and it's tint tipped as well which I really love that's something I really love I've got it on quite a few of the bears that I own as well and I really like it um yeah he's a good size he's got beans in the bottom and then he's quite soft on the top very similar to jelly cat very very similar um yeah really really pleased i love his little gangly feet as well um and the embroidered wren on the foot as well that's really really nice um yeah really really happy really happy with that that was a nice little buy um yeah so definitely check out purple holly because they've got some really good deals. Again, I got him for a much cheaper price on Purple Holly than the actual Rendell uh, website. Because the Rendell website, it was like literally like £10 more expensive. Um, so, you know, you're saving 10 quid. That's including postage as well. So I think that's a really good buy. Can't go wrong, really. And he's just absolutely adorable. I love him. He's so sweet. Um... I've got to be honest, in terms of owls, because I really love owls. They're like one of my favourite animals. Um, there's not, like, the, the trolley bear owls are really, really expensive. They're lovely, but they're really expensive. And they're not that cuddly. They're lovely, a lot of detail. You know, I'm not saying I wouldn't buy one. I'd have to see what they look like in person. But with Elvis, he just looks so cuddly and cute. And with the jelly cat owls, I've got to be honest, they're just not as... They didn't have as much detail and they weren't as cute. I just think he's a lot cuter than the jelly cat owls. I love jelly cat, absolutely love it. But in terms of the owls, I, I'm just not as big on them as I am with him. So that's why I chose to go for him and get one of the Rendell... Uh, plushes because I do really like them they're really really sweet and they're not if you get them from the right place they're not that expensive they're not that expensive anyway they're like similar price to like a standard jelly cat but um if you get them from somewhere online you can get tend to get really good deals like I got like 10 pound off like I said so it really didn't turn out not to be that expensive at all uh, definitely in comparison to Charlie Bear, which is more of a kind of treat, really. Um, but yeah, really, really happy with that. Absolutely adorable. Love the tag as well. I think there's some information there as well about about him and his character. Bit gutted it didn't come with the uh, canvas bag, but overall, really, really happy. So I highly recommend Purple Holly and Rendell if you haven't looked already. So yeah, that's my review of Elvis the Owl. And this is the larger size. I totally forgot to mention that. It's the larger size, not the junior size. I prefer the larger size. But yeah, have a good evening.